What's going on? It's Jeremy Hassel here at GAC headquarters hanging out with the rest of the grown ass kids, but everyone here is so tired from celebrating the one year anniversary with Hotspot 10 June. Now, in New York City, there's one thing we love is a place where you can find your favorite celebrities, partying with trendsetters, and partying with regular people like you, all in one spot. Now, there are some surprise performances that you guys will not see anywhere else, so stay tuned. Now, a lot of celebrities showed up. Let me just name a few. Like my man Diddy was there, Kim Porter, Daddy Yankee, Jamie Lynn Sigler, DJ Cassidy, and the Retro Kids, Aubrey O'Day and Dawn Richards from Danny Kane. Now Pete Wentz from Fall Out Boy got behind the DJ set and started spinning for the crowd while Ashley Simpson was dancing and kissing him and having a blast cheering him on. Yeah, it was that kind of event. There was Herb Williams, Jason Kidd, the cast of Rescue Me like Jennifer Esposito, Kaye Thorne, Michael Lombardi, and many more. Cat the Luna, Danielle Fischel, Lance Bass, All-American Rejects, Chef Sam Talbot, Adrian Bailon from Cheetah Girls, Natasha Bedingfield, Eve, Seth Meyers from Saturday Night Live, Craig David, LL Cool J, Ja Rule, Herb Gotti, Andy Roddick, Greg Nice, Kuba Gooding Jr., Miri Ben Ari, Mae Anderson, Greg Bello, Pam Got the Disco, and so much more. Now there are some special performances that I could tell you about, but better yet, let's just show it to you. And make sure you stay tuned because one celebrity even takes our camera and takes it for a ride. 10 June, happy anniversary, baby. Way to keep it flavorful and sexy. I think about the 10th of June and how it's going into fall right now. But I'm actually excited to be here and be DJing, and hopefully I won't ruin it. And everybody will dance, it'll be fun. <laughs> To Rand Jeremy Hassel, the original grown ass kid, with two other grown ass kids. Right here, we have Mr. Eugene Rem. What's up? How are you guys? All right, and Mr. Mark Brumbaugh. Nice to see you. How are you? Now, these two guys are the creators of 10 June. How did this come about? Uh, 10 June came about about two years ago. We were thinking about opening our own place together. We were competing nightclubs, more or less, across the street from each other. And uh, we set out to do it, and here we are two years later, although it's our one year anniversary now, which is fast and uh, exciting. It's good. So what was the concept you thought about before even opening this club? Um, the concept was to pretty much create a an intimate setting where you know we could take care of all our friends, all our regulars, and create an environment where you can have a club when you want a club, have a bar when you want a bar, and there's a lounge area, so the room's broken down to three areas. So you could have the high energy club, medium energy bar, and low energy lounge. <laughs> I think it's just like, you know, the crowd, the, the type of, of, of music that they play is very diverse. It doesn't stick just to one genre of music. And it's just, it's a feel good place. Like even like, I believe in all that, like how you position the room and then like what the chemistry it brings. I love it. tables it got a little crazy they had to ask us to get off because too many guys were fainting it was crazy because the hottest boys in town own it you know, i think eugene and mark do a great job of uh you know letting their friends have fun and you know it's all about how you run a place and people feel very welcome i'm not planning on performing i mean you know if they throw a mic in my face i might say a few words of encouragement that happen to run you know what i mean we're gonna have some fun we're gonna do it up it's 10 june baby you know how we do this is the 10th year anniversary. It's a beautiful thing. I feel great, you know what I'm saying? I feel like the Godfather. I feel like Yoda. I feel like it's been like, like I'm the embodiment. I feel like an icon. I feel good about what I'm doing. Let me get a little hands up and I'll chase them out of my They call me back. I'm gonna make it back, 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 I'm gonna make it back,
so excited performing when he saw the grown ass kids that he asked to get the camera turned it around and gave you guys his vision welcome to LL Cool Cam <laughs> Here. We've been to a lot of crazy parties, but since you guys are here every night, what's some of the parties you think about when I say the best parties you guys have had? I mean, I have to start with our first night. You know, Puffy came in, hosted our first night with a lot of great people. Penelope Cruz, Jermaine Dupri, Janet Jackson, Jay-Z, Beyonce, Kanye West. Um, it was a great way to start the start it off, and we've been blessed with great people supporting us and people that we've maintained relationships with for all these years. They like it, and I mean, you can get anyone to a club once, but I think what's really great about what Mark and I do is that we get people back, so. Hello, Ten Dune, I'm Natasha Benningfield. Happy anniversary. Why do you think they've been consistently a great club for this last year? Well, I think because of the great people that uh, they attract. Uh, when you have great people, great things happen in the management, from uh, the, the crowds, you know, to the DJ, you couldn't ask for a better situation. Happy birthday, Ten June. It's your one year birthday. Happy, happy, happy. I remember exactly a year ago, I DJed your first party, June Ambrose book release, hosted by Diddy, where we debuted this man's song, O'Neal McKnight, Check Your Coat. Tell him how that felt that night. It felt so good, man. You know what I mean? I couldn't believe it that Diddy was embracing me like that. Cast, they threw it out there. You know what I'm saying? It was like magic, man. <laughs> Happy one year anniversary, Tenjun. I'm so excited to be here for the first time on your first year anniversary. Heard so many great things about it. I've heard the food is wonderful and the club is popping. So definitely excited to have a good time here. Happy anniversary. People like coming here. It makes them feel good hanging out you know it's all about how it makes you feel you know it's, it's never like one truth why 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 you know it's just it's very personal stuff like that and people seem to like this, this club i am andre harrell and happy anniversary to mark eugene and the whole 10 june family welcome can you give me an inside story because you're an insider type dude about 10 june a time that you had here an inside story, an insider story. that nobody knows that no one knows i can't tell hmm. <laughs> Hey yo, I know what would have been all y'all for coming out and shit. I know y'all, a lot of y'all here is close friends of his and shit. Probably eat here a lot and party here a lot. So I'm going to be seeing y'all because I eat here and party here a lot. <laughs> Next love, happy birthday, Tenju. Happy birthday, Mark. Congratulations. Now, what's the future of Tenju? Well, we're in a good area. Meatpacking District's not going anywhere, I don't think. So uh, I expect that this has some legs other than, you know, the nightclubs where you think they're in and out so fast. I think this one will, will be around for a while. we got to stay on top of it. It's like, you know, the ocean. You, know, you can't turn your back on it. So I, I, truly yeah. believe, I truly believe that year two is going to be as great as year one, and the trend of nightclubs fizzling and fading out only works when you don't take care of people properly. So. Fire staff, Alex, Eric, Danny, our entire crew that works here every night. Uh -huh. You guys are the best! All of us here at GagCity.com want to wish Ten June a happy anniversary and we can't wait till next year. They always have surprise performances and consistently great nights. We'll see you guys there. Enjoy.